Welcome in and thanks for joining us at 10 o'clock. I'm Spencer Soisher. It was initially called a suspicious death and now it's being investigated as a murder. The person who found a man along Fountain Creek Wednesday says he knew the guy, but the body was in such bad shape he didn't even recognize him. KRDO News Channel 13's Barbara Fox joins us in studio now. And Barbara, you spoke with Paul Montoya who found the body and he's looking for answers about why this happened. Spencer, Paul Montoya regularly feeds the homeless. He was doing it along Fountain Creek Wednesday when he found a 67-year-old Ronald Thompson. He didn't recognize him. He didn't recognize that was Ronald until the Pueblo County Coroner released his name Friday. Now he's hoping someone knows something about what happened. I didn't recognize little, little Ronnie, the body. I didn't recognize who it was. Pueblo police are investigating a murder after a body was found Wednesday near Fountain Creek. Paul Montoya regularly walks Fountain Creek. He feeds the homeless. But on Wednesday, he found that body. He was shocked to learn it was a man he knew so well. I never thought I'd seen that person because the way his body was found, the way he was found, the way I found him, you know, it's indescribable. It was 67-year-old Ronald Thomas. He's here on the left. Montoya says Thomas has been living at the river bottom for over 10 years. You know, he was one of the first guys I met when I started working with the homeless way back in 2010. He was already down there at the river bottoms. To Montoya, he was little Ronnie, or old man Ron, to many who live along the creek. Everybody sat down there at the river bottom, that new little Ronnie. It's sad down there. You know, they all feel the effect. So now they all got to be on their toes and watch themselves a little closer for their own safety. Montoya says little Ronnie was not a violent person. It was partially why Montoya finds it so hard to believe. Every time I would go down there and honk to take food and socks and gloves and blanket during the wintertime, it, he would kind of be the one of the last ones to come to the truck. So he made sure everybody else got got what they needed before him. That's why it affects me the way it does, because he made sure everybody, everybody else had what they needed before himself. Now he wonders who did this as Pueblo police investigate. Somebody knows what happened and hope they step forward and they find the one who did it to him and did justice prevail, did justice prevail. Pueblo police say that does, not, that does appear to be an isolated incident and there is no threat to the community. They have not released more information on their investigation or how they believe Montoya was murdered. Reporting in the studio, Barbara Fox, KRDO, News Channel 13.